Hey, how's it going? It's me, Sunny Lion. Uh, so I'm making this because I wanted to rant about this. I don't have anyone to talk to about it. Uh, but there's something that I noticed that not nearly enough people are talking about, which is the uh, Dragonborn traits they added with Fizzbins, right? 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 So yeah, I know I'm late. Fizzbins has been out for a while, but I've, I've, no one's talking about it. No one's talking about this thing. I mean, people are, but not nearly enough of them are. All right. So look, 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 look. All right. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? The new Dragonborn uh, traits, which I am definitely letting my players use as, like, a feat. Because, well, one fucking... One of them is... I, I'll get into it. One of them is terrible. I'll get into it. It's just from a storytelling standpoint, some of these are the coolest in the world. Alright? So, with the Chromatic Dragonborn, uh, at 5th level, Chromatic Warding. As an action, you can channel your Draconic Energy to protect yourself. For one minute, you become immune to the damage type assorted with your chromatic ancestry. Once you use this trait, you can't do such a long rest. Obviously, I'm going to let any Dragonborn take this as a feat, because this is the coolest sh just like visually for players. Naturally, it's just the chromatic colors, you know, acid, lightning, poison, fire, cold. So you're fighting like a horrible, like, space squid. And you, and you know what, you know, it's been blasting shit with lightning, so you obviously the blue Dragonborn is going to pop their chromatic warding for a whole ass minute and just tank that shit off like it was nothing. And that is the coolest thing in the world, right? You're just fighting like a big old monster and it's like her plow bow and you're just like, nah. Like, come on, that's the coolest in the world. Like, there's so many great, like, moments that could make. Like, I can't be the, the only one who's thought of this. Bad ability, chromatic warding. Like, you get it at level 5. Just take it as a feat. I'm making it a feat for my players to use because that is just the coolest shit for any of the Dragonborn. Imagine an Amethyst Dragonborn, right? Immune to force damage. You're fighting a wizard and he tries to cast Disintegrate like nothing. Just nothing. Like, that's the coolest shit in the world. Like, that is just, it just makes for so much cool player moments. And that's what I am all about. Your goddamn gold dragonborn paladin, like, it's ready to rock, gets hit by a big-ass fireball, and then just walks that shit off like it was nothing. Come on! There's so many opportunities, dude. There's so many, like, ways that, in, like, a story that could just be done in the coolest way ever. And no one's talking about it. I hear everyone wants to talk about the, the elder brain dragon and the dragon horde mimic. Which, you know, those are cool, those are awesome, don't get me wrong. Imagine the hype that would happen if, if, where, hold on, let me, let me, I got the book here, so let me, I don't want to get it wrong. You're fighting, uh, 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 uh whatchamacallit, you're fighting, uh, uh, I'm spacing because I'm recording and that, this is what happens. Uh, some illithids. And, and, and you know it's about to go down. You're an Emerald Dragonborn. You pop your chromatic warding, or I guess gem warding, whatever. And now you're immune to psychic damage. They start trying to brain blast people, and you are just aren't affected, and they'll hit her like, what the fuck? I mean, granted, now the hive knows that you're immune to their psychic thing. Like, that's just like such a good storytelling moment. You, you, you can trick the entirety of the of the Illithids because they have the, 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 the shared brain mind thing. They can't talk words. Uh, to thinking that you're just immune to their psychic bullshit and they'll just be like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, it's, it's just so good. It's such a good, it's so cool. It's so amazing. And, and, and they, I see nothing. I see no, no one's talking about it. No one's talking about it. People talk about how hot Chromatic Dragonborn on the goddamn book, which, you know, he is very attractive, I'm not gonna lie. This is amazing. This is glorious. I love this. And and, and just for just for Gem Dragonborns, I mean, that's the coolest in the world. I want to be a Gem Dragonborn player. Those are fucking awesome. Necrotic Damage Breath, that's the coolest. That's so cool. Force Damage Breath, amazing. We love it. We love that here. And of course, 
the the metallic dragon getting the innervating and repulsion breath if you're a dragon boy i'll give give you a feat for it you want to be able to have a actually really good stun breath aoe stun breath incapacitated to the start of the so the metallic breath weapon at level five you gain a second breath weapon right when you take the attack action on your turn you can replace one of your attacks with an exhalation in a 15 foot cone the safer the dc is Eight plus your constitution modifier plus your proficiency bonus, which is great because there needs to be more things that use constitution modifier as an attack. In my opinion, I, I just think it's a good thing. More variety than charisma. Whenever you use this trait, you can choose one of these effects. Evanating Breath, which each creature in the cone must succeed a constitution saving throw or become incapacitated at the start of your next turn. AoE Stun Breath or Repulsion Breath, each creature in the cone must succeed a strength saving throw or be pushed 20 feet away from you and knocked prone. They gave Metallic Dragonborn a Vusroda. That's amazing. And again, there's so many ways you can use this in cool storytelling ways. Just like, oh, I mean, come on. I'm gonna let my Dragonborn players, if they want, take the Chromatic Warding as a feat. I'm gonna let them take Metallic Breath Weapon as a feat, because those are just amazing. Those are cool as hell. Uh, unfortunately for my Gem Dragonborns, they get... Where is it? At level 5. Flight. Which is, um... I mean, just go be an ASMR. I think they just always have that. I don't think they even need to hit level five. I, I don't, I don't recall at the moment. But um, I mean, I guess they can talk to each other telepathically. That's cool. I mean, maybe it's better. Hold on, let me actually read it out loud so that I don't prove myself stupid immediately. Starting at fifth level, you can use a bonus action to manifest spectral wings on your body. These wings last for one minute. For the duration, you gain flying speed equal to your walking speed and can hover. Once you use this trait, you can't do so again until you finish a long rest. Yeah, that's definitely not nearly as cool as walking, shrugging off fireballs and chain lightnings like it's nothing. Vus bro dying a group of goblins off a cliff for lulls. Or just like AoE stun blasting a bunch of people. Uh, I would definitely just let my players hover whenever they want as a gem, gem dragon, because that's that's cool. That sounds like fun. It's a little neat little thing. I actually have a hard time, now that I think about it, trying to find interesting ways to make gem dragons feel unique outside of just, like, their visual design, but actually, like, into playing and RPing as them. I would definitely let them hover to kind of give them a un little unique thing, some type of repulsion field, I guess. I don't know. Outside of letting them take the chromatic warding so that they can be immune to force damage so that I can't just disintegrate my players anymore. But yeah, that is that has been what this is. I have just yelled about how cool they've made Dragonborns because no one's been talking about this enough. This is so f***ing cool. Go play D&D. &D. Go make a gem dragon and f***ing go be amazing. This has been me talk, yelling about Dungeons and Dragons for 10 minutes or more. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to edit it down to. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. We have content. Check it out. It's cool. Thank you. Have a great day. And they start trying to brain brass. Oh, God, I can't talk.